Ah, oh, Martin, this is the life. A day on the beach at the seaside resort of Huayin. Oh, I tell you what, Dan, it does not get any better than this. I fancy getting my bucket and speed out. I might even go for a horse ride on the beach. Do you fancy a wee bit of Tuesdays? Ah, uh, yeah. What? <laughs> We've got a show to make. Let's go. We better go over all the tails. Crikey. <laughs> Welcome to this week's What's On Thailand show with Inspire. I'm Dan Cheeseman and this is Martin Carlisle. And today we're at the seaside resort of Hoi Hin on the Gulf of Thailand. And behind us we're at the Hoi Hin Marriott Resort and Spa. And I must say, it's wonderful to be out of the studio. It is indeed, Dan. It's a little bit of a busman's holiday. If you're from UK, you'll know what we're talking about because it's not all fun and games, no. We're actually here doing a lot of work. We're going to be attending the Wahin Business Network. Uh, we're actually going to be filming the show, obviously, in the, uh, the Marriott here and uh, we're going to be heading over to Bang Sien and finding out about the Speed Festival there in the Thailand Super Series and of course we'll get the events from throughout Thailand on the show. Mm. What a life we leave but trust me it's very tiring all this travel isn't it? Yes it is indeed but first before we go anywhere else we're going to head over to Thai Visa and have a look at the viral photographs. why Britney Spears featured so heavily in those photos with this position is because she's just finished her concert in Bangkok and that picture was actually captured somewhere in the big city and it's been photoshopped into many different scenarios. Very amusing. Yes, and something else that's very amusing is if you're trying to learn the Thai language and you're feeling miserably, well, we've got the very thing for you. We've got Ooh, which is a useful phrase to learn the Ting Tong Thai. Hi guys, this is Ting Tong Thai with your crazy but lovable teacher Wu. I will teach you the Thai you really need to know. Thai is easy. Listen and learn this word. It's all about tone like singing a lovely song when it comes to speaking Thai. Ready? White cow. News cow. Rice, cow. Mountain, cow. Knee, cow. Enter, cow. One more time, just in Thai. Cow, cow, cow. Cow, cow, cow. Don't make fit like that, my smart student. Easy peasy, Japanese. Bye for now. Ting tong Thai. Learn the Thai you really need to know. Bye bye. <coughs> Thanks Ting Tong Thai, learning Thai. I've had 80 hours so far and it's a minefield. It's like a musical instrument, tonal and flowing. I give up. No, I would give up if I were you. Now, moving from that area, we're going to head over now to Bangkok. Exciting place, the hottest city in the world, the worst traffic in the world. But wow, what a place to visit, lots happening there. We've got our very own Ash keeping us up to date with all the events in the Big Mango. G'day, I'm Ash, I live here in Bangkok and it's my job to keep you informed with some cool stuff happening in this big city. This is one for all our American friends. The 4th of July party at Game Over, Liberty Plaza, Sukhumvit Soy 55. Celebrate American Independence Day with a real American barbecue, super chilled beer and classic American films along with multiple games and activities plus special offers for those who dress in American flag attire. This event starts at 5.30pm and it's free to get in. 
Okay, next up we have for you G Dragon World Tour, Act 3, July the 7th and 8th at Impact Arena. I can't really give you much more info on this, but I've just been told that they're supposedly Korean guys. Um, I've never bloody heard of them at all, but it's 2,500 baht a ticket, and they have some big companies sponsoring the event, so they must go all right. So get on down if you like Korean music. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Ashin Bangkok Song of the Week in association with Thai Visa Radio. <laughs> And this is a pretty cool one also. Wednesday the 12th of July is the five year anniversary for the, one of the coolest clubs in town, which is Levels. It attracts some of the hottest birds you will find in Bangkok. Heaps of giveaways and also an international DJ lineup. It will be a good night this. I might even see you there. Or sorry, you might even see me there. <laughs> Okay, Thursday the 6th of July at Glow Nightclub is playing host to Nick Brill. He is a house DJ coming all the way from Belgium. Glow is Bangkok's underground techno club with a banging sound system. Dancing shoes and disco biscuits is all you will require. <laughs> Free entry also. Thank you for tuning in. I hope I found something that floats your boat. Happy travels and keep it safe. What's orange and sounds like parrot? A carrot. I used to be addicted to soap, but I'm clean now. Very cheesy, I know, but, but I love cheese. Inspiredbangkok.com for events and offers. Bye for now. Yibidi yibida. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this break. I'll go it alone. somebody else if I'm not right for me I gotta be free daring to try to do it or die I've gotta be me I'll go it alone that's how it must be daring to try Welcome back to the What's On Thailand show with Inspire. Yes, you join me here at the Wahin Marriott Resort and Spa. And we're going to pop over to Dan, who's having a chat with Gina, the marketing manager. Right, I'm joined by Gina, the marketing manager here at the Marriott Resort Hoi Hin. Hi Gina. Hello Dan. Uh, how is Hoi Hin at the moment? Hoi Hin is doing great Dan. Um, like always, soon it's going to be the weekend, we're going to have a lot of Bangkokians coming over like always. Mm. Okay, so it's quite a new resort in Hoi Hin. Talk to me about some of the facilities here. Okay, so we have 322 rooms all in all, different categories. And then we have five pools, which is obviously one of the highlights. Uh, we also have five F&B outlets, starting from two restaurants, two bars and... Where we are now. And, and there's a reason we're here now, because this is one of the latest additions to your hotel. Um, why would someone come and check this place out, the bakery? Well, the bakery is not located inside the hotel per se. It's more uh, adjacent to the hotel. So the idea is to give it a sort of Starbucks feel for people to come in and sit and mingle. Um, we have Wi-Fi free here. There's coffee, there's sandwiches, there is all sorts of uh, nice bakeries. 
um, should be a good place to just have a seat and rest. Yeah, I think we'll go for a coffee now, have a croissant, exactly. and in the meantime, I'm back to Martin. Thanks, Dan. Informative as ever. Now, whilst we're in Wahen, I thought we'd pop over and speak to Jason because he knows all about the events that's happening in this area. Take it away, Jason. What's up, everyone? From me, Jason Inspire Huahin, here to keep you updated on events in this area. First up is the Huahin and Cha'am Hash House Harrier 17th Anniversary Weekend. It's on the 7th to the 9th of July. Do you know what a hash run is? Hash is not very PC. If you're easily offended by the use of four letter words, then beware. I have been. I guarantee it's a lot of fun. And if you like laughs, beer, and or running, then you will be in heaven at their events. <laughs> The Dorian Buffet is at the Venezia Huihin Cha Am from the 8th to the 10th of July for only 299 baht or 159 for kids. There's a free mini train rides and reverse house. Buffet times are set and limited to 1 hour and 15 minutes. Book your slot. Foreigners pay 60 baht more. Why? Whatever. Just give me the Mong Tong baby. I am gonna eat way more than that. Put classical music in your plans for the 2017 Culinary Classics, the late Viennese Sonatas at the beautiful Dusit Tani Huihin on the 14th of July at 6 p.m. Tickets are 600 baht with a drink or 1600 to 1800 baht with five star food choices. Next up is the Huihin Business Network July Wine Event on the 20th of July, 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. at Andriana's Bread. Entrance is 500 baht for members or 700 baht for non-members. Includes free flow wine, beer, and finger food. They ask you to please RSVP and you can sign up to be a member on the website. Next up is Centaura Grand Beach Resort and Villas Huihin is hosting a wedding showcase on the 8th of July from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Meet the wedding experts, suppliers, venue tours, drinks, food, and special offers. So, all of you preparing for the big day, go here to get acquainted with all your wedding options. And one thing, if I'm a guest at the wedding, it's all about the cake. Get the good cake and we will all say it was a delicious, I mean, a good wedding. And that's it for this week. From Jason at Inspire Huahin, wishing you lots of peace, love, health, and happiness, sending it back to you guys. <laughs> Thank you, Jason, for keeping us up to date with all the events in Wahin. We enjoyed it that much that we actually came down to the area to see yeah. what everything that's happening. Um, we're right here in the uh, Wahin Marriott Resort and Spa just now. If you look behind me, you'll see the Amber Kitchen Restaurant. You can see they've got a lovely terraced area out there if you want to uh, do some al fresco dining. They've also got an air con kitchen inside there. Do lunchtime buffies. Great down here if you fancy something to eat in Wahin. Mm, very nice. And what a smashing day down here as well. Uh, let's move on to Patia, which interestingly you can get to by the ferry now from Hoihin. The word patia derives from tapia. Useless information coming up. Tapia means tap is troop and paya is a high up official and the reason it's been given that name is because many years ago troops marched through Patia on their way to Satahip. I think the twist in the story is Patia then went on another journey many years later when the US troops landed and used the town for some much needed R&R &R and well we are where we are now. So let's find out what's happening down in Patia with Quang. Hello everyone, I'm Quang. Very nice to see you all here again. Let's check it out what's happening in and around Pattaya. On the 14th of July, we have Bastille Day celebration at New Nordic Steaks Grill and Winery down on Phantom Nak Soy 4. This event is a free admission and you can enjoy a free French food buffet and some French live music. And also they have fun game for kids. The event starts at 5 p.m. so come down and say hello. This is just another way New Nordic give back to the community. For more information, you can email events at new-nordic.com for more details. Martial arts fans, look out for the World Beach Jiu-Jitsu Tournament at Pattaya Jomtin Beach on 7th to 9th of July. This event is being hosted by the Jiu-Jitsu International Federation. So go online to inspire for ticket information. A quick mention that you can demo the new Yoti Flow Mini Paramotor and Paragliding Wing at Bira Circuit Pattaya on the 8th of July around 4.30pm. The normal price of this glider is around 50,000 baht. 
But if you order on the day, you can get an additional discount 5%. Qualified pilot can also fly the wing and let the company know what they think of it. Something for the golfers now is the Ladies European Thailand Championship at the Phoenix Gold Golf and Country Club Pattaya on the 6th to number 9th of July. Over 70 top women golfers taking part in this tournament and the prize money of this tournament is over 12 million baht. Wow! That's it from me, Guang. For more information, please visit inspirebangkok.com and bye for now! Thanks, Quang. Now, Hua Hin, what do you know about the area? Well done. At first, when I actually came to Hua Hin at first, I thought it was all about uh, horses on the beach yeah. and stuff like that. But since I've been here doing a bit of exploring, there's much more to find down here. We've got the big Blue Port Shopping Centre if you want to do a bit of shopping. There's vineyards to visit. There's lots of water parks. And of course, if you're looking for lovely high-end restaurants, there's lots to eat here in Hua Hin. And of course, it's nice and handy to head on that ferry only two hours from Pattaya. Mm, every day, that ferry. We always use it. Okay, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after the break. show with Inspire right here from Wahin and we're at the Married Resort and Spa. We hope we've given you lots of ideas of things to do in and around the Kingdom of Thailand. Don't forget to download that app. It's now available on the App Store and the Play Store for your smartphone. and Download it, Inspire Thailand. Mm. A good app that is, Martin. Now apparently, Thailand's Tourism Authority have launched an article telling all you tourists and us expats what we can do in this kingdom if it's raining, if the monsoons are here. Well, at Inspire, we already have the answers and one of them is go to the movies and in Thailand you can watch some movies in English. So Dasha, are there any good movies coming up for the week ahead? Hello everyone, it's me Dasha and I'm back. Get your soda and popcorn ready because many new and interesting things are happening at the cinema this week. The first movie I'm going to talk about is Spider-Man Homecoming. The one and only Peter Parker tries to balance his life in high school with his career. IMDb thought to give it a rating of 8.4 out of 10. This movie's genre is action and adventure. To me, it sounds like a great movie to have a look at when going out with your friends. Give it a chance. Next up is a movie with a pretty unusual name, 2.22. This thriller is about a man whose life is just a pattern that repeats itself daily and mysteriously ends at 2.22. As interesting as it sounds, IMDb gave it a rating of 5.4 out of 10. No matter what everyone else says, you should always listen to yourself. So go and check it out. Okay, last up is the Transformers 5. It's still in the cinema. I'm sure that you heard people talking non-stop about it. If you didn't have time to go and see this movie, you're lucky because you still have time to do that. See you all again next week, and remember, if anything happens, we'll always have Paris. 
Bye, everyone. Thanks, Dasha. Some good movies on. Now, if you are in Hoi Hin, like we are, we're enjoying it. It's almost like a holiday. If the rains come down, you can go to a major cinema, which is at the Market Villa Shopping Centre. Right, before we move on, I just want to plug our latest magazine designed for tourists, and it will be distributed in this triangulation zone that we keep going on about. Hoi Hin, Bangkok, Pattaya. Really, tourists and expats like us are so mobile between each region that if you see an event or offer in one of the other regions, you can easily get there. Hence why we've got this. It will be distributed in some really great places such as the Patia Hoi Hin Ferry, so when people are taking that journey. We've got shopping malls in Bangkok, Starbucks, Coffee World, Hooters, you name it. If it's a good location, we'll put it there. If you want to put your business in this, why wouldn't you? I think I will. Then email me at dan at choicegroupasia.com. There we go, a quick plug. Yeah, we always get away with a plug in the show. Um, listen, if you just look behind me, I just should point out we're at the Big Fish and Bar restaurant and it's located in the Wahen Marriott Resort and Spa and it is actually a little bit famous because it is the only air-conditioned absolute beachfront seafood restaurant. So if you fancy a little bit of seafood and you want to get a beautiful view of the Wahen Beach, then this is the place to come. Now, earlier on in the week, staying in Wahen, we had the Wahen Business Network who held their monthly event and this month it was in the Laksas Subar Resort, just off the main road of Soy 61. Of course, I took the cameras down just to chat to people and see what was happening. If you thought Hoi Hin was a sleepy seaside resort, then think again, because there's a thriving business community. And this evening, we're down at the monthly Hoi Hin Business Network at Barn Lakasuba to find out what it's all about. Okay, I'm joined by Brian, who's on the board of the Hoi Hin Business Networking Club, so I can find out a bit more about what this is. So maybe that's the starting point. What is it? Okay, the Hoi Hin Business Network, it's a group of 59 members we have now uh, from different businesses in Hoi Hin. We, we came together to bring people together so, uh, so people could meet each other, learn about what businesses they're doing, new businesses, old businesses. Uh, we're in our third year now. We meet every month. Um, Usually the last Thursday of the month, everybody's welcome. We like to increase our membership, so um, please come. Okay, you've pretty much summed it up. Uh, and how is business in Hoi Hin? Uh, well, it's like everywhere else, it's up and down, it's seasonal. Um, you know, the high season throughout the winter, it's always great, and then we, we tend to suffer a little bit in the lower season, but otherwise, um, we're all happy to be here. Okay. <laughs> Thanks very much, that's all I need. Cheers. Okay. Okay, I've managed to grab Daniel, who's the resort manager at Laksa Suba, where the event is tonight. Daniel, what does it mean to have the Hoi Hin Business Network here? For me, it's a great opportunity to get the local people to come and see the place. Um, it's amazing to see that no many people living here actually know the place. Uh, we're in the center, we're here since 10 years, so we have to get this changed into a more open place where everybody knows about it. Okay, perhaps you can describe exactly where the resort is because I know that often you can drive past if you're not looking carefully. So, if we if we tell people we're just next to Sentara, everybody knows it. Okay, that's the easiest way to and uh, explain how to find us. Pass Sentara, and we're right there. Well, thanks for the insight. Let's get back to the party. Thank you very much. So I think the message of today is there's plenty of business opportunity in Hoi Hin. If you want to get your business involved and seen in this region, then do contact the Hoi Hin Business Networking Group. They're on Facebook and who knows, maybe I'll see you here next month.
listen out for the hottest news to ever come from a radio station in Thailand. The launch of our summer schedule with the biggest DJ names in the world all together under one roof every Friday and Saturday night. Only right here on Thai Visa Radio 1. Thai Visa Radio 1. Feel good music for Thailand's new generation. Okay guys, welcome back to the What's On Thailand show with Inspire. And as you've seen earlier on, if you're uh, networking in the Wahin area, it really is a great place to go down and join the Wahin Business Network. You're going to meet lots of new people there. Mm, indeed. Okay, if you've watched previous shows, you'll know that I always harp on about this triangulation zone, the Hoi Hin, Bangkok, Pattaya region, because we can move in amongst these regions so easily. So what we've done in this next part of the show is we'll bring you some of the best offers, well, we think, are in all of them regions, and wherever you are in them areas, you can go to it. Okay, right, we're going to kick off the show. We're going to chat about the show DC, which is in Bangkok. It's a brand new shopping and entertainment mall right there in the centre of uh, Bangkok. Uh, just take the train station to Mac Kassan Station. Um, they've got shows in there, the show DC, every single day, very entertaining. And also, if you go to the tourist lounge, you will find the Thai Visa uh, kind of box, if you like, isn't it? Yeah. And uh, if you go in there, you can actually get a VIP card. That will get you 5% off discount on all purchases and full use of the tourist lounge there at Show DC. Yeah, very nice it is too down there. I took my family and they enjoyed the shows. Okay, if you enjoy your cheese, I do, then you probably want to head down to the Sofatel in Bang Rack uh, because they've got a so cheese selection by executive chef Paul Smart, which includes Brie, uh, Racletti, I think that says, Comte, Morbia, clearly French wasn't my chosen subject, Camembert, etc, etc. It's 999 baht plus plus and that includes the free flow of cheese and wait for this one and wine it's seven o'clock to 9 p.m on the first friday of every month and you'll find it at the mixo bar on the ninth floor at the sofa tell in bangrak okay right and the one i'm talking about here is the pullman bangkok king power hotel yes is that the correct one okay they have got a Brittany galette and crepe week uh, and that starts um, from monday the 17th on to sunday the 23rd of july at their wine pub yeah so it's uh, one of the best wine bars in bangkok so why not head down there and discover the secret recipes from Brittany France who reads it who writes this stuff I know we've, we've got some tongue twisters today it gets easier uh, in Patia drum roll please because it launches first of many the first Inspire Mildew launches in the Retox group which includes the Robin Hood Tavern at the Avenue the Retox Soy Diana Soy Lenky and the Retox in Darkside wait for this it's probably the best deal you've ever heard if you're looking for a bargain it's chicken tikka masala pillar rice, poppadom, some sauces, naan bread and half a pint of San Miguel Light every Wednesday for 149 baht. Just go in there and ask for the Inspire Meal Deal. Wow, how did you manage to get that one, Dan? That's a great deal, that one. Okay, listen, it's competition time. That definitely needs a drum roll. You know, every single week, we give away four tickets for the Thai Garden Resort based on North Patio Road. They've got a buffet every single night, different one, international, pizza, pasta, German. Oh, it's great there every single night. And we give away four tickets here. All you need to do is uh, email ash at choicegroupasia.com and just put on your uh, email, good day, I want to win. Every week, someday we'll win four tickets for that wonderful buffet at the Thai Garden Resort. Mm, lovely jubbly. Uh, if you're in Pattaya over the weekend, Sunday, pencil this one in, especially if you've got a family, at Fraser's Sports Bar, which is on Tapriya Road in the Chateau Dow complex. They've got their Sunday barbecue. They've also got a kids' crash area as well, so bring the kids along, let them be looked after. You can enjoy a pint, a burger, some sausage, salad. It's very nice down there. Fraser's Sports Bar on Tapriya Road. OK, 
Okay, the one I'm going to chat about now is a traditional Irish pub in a party called Dicey Riley's. They've got the Sunday Carvery every single Sunday, don't you know? They get starters, dessert, 449 bar. It starts at midday, finishes at half past three. So you better get down there quick and get a seat. It is absolutely awesome at Dicey Riley's. Okay, I'm going to squeeze one more in very quickly for Pat here. It's a Siam Siam, Siam at Siam Design Hotel, the big blue hotel by Dolphin Roundabout. Every evening from 6 p.m. it's their seafood buffet. Eat as much as you can. It's 700 bar, all for free flow of white and red wine. 990 bar, and they've got some live music as well. Nice mm. air. Okay, right, moving on to the Wahin area, because we are here, I want to chat about the prime steak, uh, just right in the centre of Wahin, just round the corner from the Hilton Disco, if you know where that is. Uh, anyway, they've got a special on just now. It's the Angus Burger and Chips and a bottle of San Miguel Light. Normally comes in at 520 baht. They've got a special offer just now, 395 baht every single day. So just pop into the uh, prime steak and, uh, yeah, uh, have a look at that and try your Angus Burger. Mm. And I just want to add, that's our second Inspire Meal Deal Ooh, in Hua Hin. Uh, okay, Father Ted's just around the corner from Prime Steak, so maybe you can start off. Top here. of the morning. Yeah, thanks to uh, David Long for the hospitality last night. We had a few pints of the black stuff. It's actually on Soy 61. It's an authentic Irish pub, really the only Irish pub of note in Hoi Hin. Uh, on Friday they do a lads night which is happy hour prices on all the beer. They've even got a Sunday roast as well. It's a place to go if you like the crack. Mm, yeah, it's okay. Now, I don't know why you gave me this one, Dan. He's talking about fitness, and he knows I'm the most unfit person in the whole of Thailand. But we get Palapon Fitness, which is located in Wahin, and uh, they do the weight loss camp right here in the centre of Wahin. Um, regarded as one of the most popular fitness training centres in the country, don't you know? Mm. Um, and it's excellent. So if you want to get in shape, try out Palapon just off the Pech Kasim Road in Wahin, near actually Kautaki up a little bit, it isn't is, it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Okay, that's it for that section. Let's move on now to the viral video of the week doing the rounds on Thai Visa's Facebook page. Take a look. And that's the end of the show. Wherever you're watching in Thailand, all the best and do make the most of your time whilst here in this great country. Thanks to Gina and everyone else at the Hoi Hin Marriott Resort and Spa and to all the businesses we met at the Hoi Hin Business Networking. Martin, before we run to the beach, what are we going to finish on? Well, this week um, we actually popped down to Bangsia and they had the uh, street racing down there and it was a Thailand Super Series. I took the cameras down there and I should pop out. We were filming the Unix TR Motorsport Porsche and uh, let's have a look and we'll see everyone else next week for the What's On Thailand show.